Hey guys, good morning and welcome to our cozy garden. And today I am very excited to finally start our first mushroom patch. A few months ago, I have started looking at how I can grow my own mushrooms. And I know we've been using them a lot in our cooking here at home. And um, I was very curious whether there are mushroom varieties that I can easily grow here in Zone 3, Alberta, Canada. So last Sunday, we went to a farmer's market here in the city and saw someone from the mycogardener.ca. And they were selling these um, mushroom blocks, mushroom mycelium blocks. Now, this variety, he said, is one of the best ones to grow here in Alberta. And this one is wine caps, Stropharia robustanulata but this one will take a few weeks more because it hasn't um, fully occupied the soil block yet so this will stay inside until that happens um, but at the same time we did buy a mushroom block from happy caps now this one is an oyster uh, oyster mushroom and he was saying we can also use this to grow mushrooms outdoors. Now, he said that when you grow mushrooms outdoors, the mycelium network is actually stronger. It has a better resilience from diseases and bacteria. So I can still use this. And instead of this, I can use my oyster mushroom mycelium block to create my first mushroom patch here in our cozy garden so to do that i will have to dig out this uh, garden bed and the suggestion is two feet by three feet so i can do like maybe up to here and then take the soil out and then have about eight to twelve inches of uh, substrate mulch and for that they are suggesting to use hardwood chips so I also got this for ten dollars this one was for twenty dollars and um, this one was 25 but um, I'm gonna use this for this one so that's my next step I'm gonna dig this out and then put a uh, cardboard box underneath that would help if there are any seeds in there that would help uh, kill it and then or in in my mind it's also a way to keep the patch clean and as few uh, dirt uh, on the surface as possible so I will do that but it's about to rain so I might need to use just one camera for now okay. <laughs> Thank you. 